So this tutorial will um, explain to you how to uh, send uh, data to the Wasmo uh, network gateway, which is the smaller, uh, the smaller one. It's not the Wasmo; it's the other one. But anyway, so uh, this video will show you the, the what you need to do before you actually set up the um, the network. So. Uh, we have to ensure that uh, all all communication are on the same channel and the same uh, personal uh, personal ID, personal area network. So um, uh, what we have to do first is open the uh, source editor and. So an array zero one two zero three four. So our network, our uh, personal area network ID is equal to um, one two three four. Second step. So the first step uh, in the setup, we put the channel, and the set pan. Um, and then we up upload this to the was mode. So once you finish uploading this code to your WASP mode, you will have um, uh, your network will be channel D communication, and your your personal area network ID will be one two three four. Okay. Now if you don't want to use XCTU, you'd have to use uh, the API provided by Logilion. So once you uh, upload uh, this to your WASP mode, then you would write your program. So in this program, um, I want to send all the accelerometer values. So we initialize the accelerometer and the RTC. We initialize the RTC. And also, I need to initialize the uh, radio module. So xbao2 dot on xbao2 dot init, and in here we'll put The module name and the frequency, and whether it's uh, the, the type. Is, I'm using the normal um, radio modules. Okay, so this is what we'll have in the setup. In the loop, we will have one s print. S print is string print. So uh, here I have to initialize um, the char array. So uh, so data, let's call it data to send, and give it 100. It's of size 100 bytes. So data to send. So I'll be sending that accelerometer values, and they contain x coordinate, y coordinate, and z coordinate. And then I will send the RTC, which is the temperature. Uh, 
and it will have a null a null a null termination characters in the end. Uh, so the acc dot get x is the first point I'm gonna get, and get y is the second. acc dot get z is the last one, and then I'm getting the temperature in the RTC. Temperature. Then I have the termination characters slash r slash n. Now I need to set the um, I need to set the destination. So I'm receiving. So just copy this from the. Any example, and you have to make sure that you initialize the the pointer that it, that it's using. So pack sent. So here I will modify it to the unicast packet ID zero fifty two, and here I'm using Mac type. And the final gateway is uh, here is zero four zero six nine one eight BC. Uh, your your MAC address of the network gateway, and I'm sending data to send. All right, and let's say a delay of one thousand. So every second it will send send these data okay so it's after you compile it what you could do also here is um, get the actual size of the data using the size of command and now you just do a print line of it and see how much it actually is you want to save um, if you want to save uh, space that is okay and then once you have all that you can upload it to the to the wasmart all right so let's plug it in So where is it? I'm writing is it this one. Is it this one? All right. So USB one, and I upload. Okay. So if you're using Linux, then. Um, uh, you might be familiar with a program called Qtcom. You know, uh, I've got uh, Qtcom opened right now, and I've got the network gateway listening on um, uh, TTY USB zero. Okay, so if I turn on the WASP mode, and as you can see, the first, uh, the first, the first. Um, Introduction of the frame or the beginning of the frame is just the the frame type and the frame ID and all that stuff, which are mentioned in the API used by the um, DigiMesh uh, or, uh, XB radios. So they all have those um, what you call sections of in, in the frame. But regardless, you, um, you have the data f the data frame here, as you can see the. I'm, I'm changing now the direction of so you have the ACC accelerometer values yeah, as you can see they're changing um, and then you got the temperature which is 
29 degrees constant uh, but regardless it's um, it's all here so uh, hopefully that helps thank you